First, we're going to start with some good news. Proof of making. Proof of making. Not, not completed, but proof of making. It's like proof of life for people who are hostages, but with making things. So let's start with the good news, the proof of making. Here are two things. I'm going to have a follow-up video on what they are and why I'm making them. Uh, but they, I have to say, I'm super happy. I don't know, I mean, if you, if you are a machinist and are like, those are horrible machining marks, never ever, um, let me know, and let me know what they should, what I should be doing that would get rid of them. This is, uh, the only thing I use was WD-40 for lubricant, and it's a, a four flute mill, H, uh, high speed steel, so, you know, but they're pretty. This one was off off center. I probed to the corners, and then because I'm using a router, which there's no tool offsets because you're setting your tool manually every time. I you know I wanted to jog it to where it belonged, and I jogged it to where it belonged, and then promptly didn't zero it, so it ran everything a eighth of an inch in the wrong direction. This one was perfect, and I was there's actually two operations. There's the first operation here you can see. And then there's a second operation um, where you flip it over uh, and you cut out uh, the the other side of it. And I was all ready to flip it over and cut out the other side of it. Um, and uh, this is this is why I need to turn this big piece of metal into a brace that uses this grid for my vice because my vice moved and. Well, I mean, I suppose I could spend a bunch of time trying to re-zero the vise. It's a big pain in the butt. Don't really want to deal with it right now because it's pretty. It's been a long day. Um, the old machine has been donated, so um, I want to include just to make everybody, you know, anybody who actually watches this say, yeah, but but, you know, first, you know, I have this. I have some video of this guy getting cut. I have video of this guy getting surfaced, and then I ran out of disk space. So you. I might include it too, just because. But a bit of video for this guy getting surfaced. Um, so good news, proof of making, with pretty cool finish. I, you know, let me know if it's wrong or right. I ended up uh, polishing. <laughs> Talk about zero. Uh, I zeroed off of this. Actually, this is kind of cool. Um, uh, so here's here's my here's my zero gauge. Except I didn't use it like a gauge. I actually just, you know, so. Right, your classic zero probe. What I did is I flipped the probe over and had it actually conducting through this surface. You can see that mark, those marks. I don't know if that's like horrible or survivable. Um, guess you're not really using the. Anyways, um, I need soft jaws. That probably solved the whole problem. Um, but it was kind of cool. I, I used, the, I did, I did that. So the current was running down there, and then I clipped on this, and I actually zeroed off of this surface. I can zero off of this surface too, but. Um, I thought it was creative way to zero because when I zeroed using this, the math was got really weird and stupid. And even though that should have been a perfect zero, um, it was off by a lot. So um, I don't know why. Oh, I'll have to look into that. The but the the moral of the story. Those are pretty cool. And lock down your damn vice. Which anybody who's a real machinist and is not using a table CNC table router as a machinist's area and yeah I mean it's kind of like why am I boiling the ocean I, because I don't have a Tormach or other CNC mill uh, and we've already covered that maybe in a future video I will who knows alright so hang out for a little longer because I'm gonna include a couple of cut videos snippets for this the speeds are real slow uh, 10,000 RPM, surfacing at uh, 10 inches a minute, 10,000 RPM, just super slow. Um, and uh, the edges were, everything was everything was 10,000 RPM, and then I think all my cuts were at uh, 20 inches a minute. S super slow. But, you know, just learning, learning, vice, tighten it down, have it actually locked down to the surface. We'll cover that. We'll cover that in another video. It's awesome. I have a whole plan. It's amazing. I'll definitely make sure to record cutting out the big block. You can see that. Is that the big block? Yeah. We'll see what that's like. All right. Latest. Oh, subscribe.
You know how that works, wherever that is, that way. That way? There. I think it's there. Thank you.